Every time you get out of bed, a billion possible paths launch out of your toes. I know it doesn't seem like it, but I'm pretty sure that's true. I've lived a dozen different lives so far. And I'm not bragging, it was done out of desperation. I fled my small hometown and landed in the arms of a college musical theater department. That decision probably saved my life. And then I just kept running for the next 20 years. Anytime I experienced disappointment or heartbreak, I'd pack my belongings and hit the road in search of a new start. That's one thing my fundamentalist church had right. I was a lost soul. But it led to some wild, albeit questionable, life choices. I became an accidental adventurist. I moved to New York City about 97 times, once in the early 90s, and I hung out at an old church turned nightclub. It was the limelight. I didn't do drugs because of Jesus. I took a job on a cruise ship in South America. We went down the Amazon River. The water looked like creamy coffee and the houses were on stilts. There was a man with a monkey and you could touch it for a dollar. And I did. I moved to LA with a hot guy who was 10 years younger than me. I barely knew him. And that ended exactly how you think it would, maybe worse. For a long time after, it felt like the ability to love had been burned out of me. One era after another, packing up and running head over heels into the next. It would be pathetic had it not pieced together this tragically gorgeous life. It is me. And it's made me acutely aware of this. Every time you get out of bed, a billion possible paths launch out of your toes. I know it doesn't seem like it, but I'm pretty sure it's true.